Well, the fifth celebrity couple tonight to grace the dance floor is Joni Mix and Daniel Klinkhammer, who will perform a bolero Pasa Doble medley. <laughs> My name is Daniel Flinkhammer. I am a dance instructor and the one of the artistic directors of Rochester Dance Company. My name is Joni Mix and I am the owner of the Dance Lab Dance Studio in Rochester. Um, I have danced on stage probably a hundred or so times, but I have never done so in a partner setting such as this. This is my third time dancing with Dancing for the Arts. I have danced on stage before quite a few times, but also this is a little bit out of my comfort zone. I think the arts are really important in the community, especially when you're working with kids and trying to develop their unique skills and teach them how they can use those skills when they get to be older and be active in the community as an adult. I think the arts make life interesting and exciting and keep people around doing things, going out, having fun. What we are about to present for Dancing for the Arts has never been done before for Dancing for the Arts. And I think for that reason alone, you should vote for us. You should vote for us because we can do this. Vote for us! Oh, you guys. That was truly mesmerizing and captivating. Congratulations, what a performance. Joni, <laughs> amazing. Daniel, so Joni, you are a dancer and you're typically the teacher. And for tonight, for this great cause, you were the student. What was that like for you? It's really nice. Breath of fresh air. <laughs> <Good>. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Daniel, I got a question, man. All right. You, how do you... 
That, that thing? Randy has that, been trying just, all day was, in the seats really, over like, there. How do you make that happen? Years and years and years and years and years of practice. Right. You've hit the floor thousands of times. Well earned. You guys did a great job. Well, let's ask our celebrity judges what they thought. Sheriff Torgerson, what'd oh, you think? Boy, goodness. First of all, that move would have put me in traction for a month. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It was mesmerizing. You captured our attention from the beginning. I was like, uh, do I need to do something with these uh -oh. before these people uh -oh. get too far uh -oh. down the road? Oh, my. No, wait a minute. I probably should put those away. Anyway, it was, you lit, the mercury was rising on the dance floor. You lit it up. You guys were amazing. Thank you. That wonderful work. So I, all I've got is I've got this shocked face on here because I'm like, I, I don't, that's, that's amazing. Good job. Well done. Excellent. Thank you, Sheriff. And Lisa. I totally agree with you, Sheriff. I said we should call the fire department <laughs> because I'm telling you, you had that dance floor on fire. And it was, it was just it. so sexy. Um, you built the energy throughout the entire performance, so you never let us down. I felt like we were holding our breath the whole time. There was never a down, which was very exciting. And the trust was quite evident throughout, with all your moves, with all your lifts, with all your twirls, and wherever else you were doing over there. <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was quite fascinating to watch. Thank you. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you, Lisa. And Sharon. That was incredibly intense. I'm still breathing hard. <laughs> it was so intense. Um, your connection to each other and to the audience and to the floor, balance and connection and weight into the floor was amazing. And the, the fact that you were so coordinated in your arm styling, everything was matched. Even when you weren't looking at each other, it was, it was all matched. It's obvious you really put the work into this. It was fabulous. Indeed, they were absolutely fabulous. Another round of applause for Joni and Daniel. Thank you. Thank you so much, you two. Thank you for giving your time as well.